Hello guys, in this video we'll tell you how to fix the hard drive not installed issue in Windows 10 or 11. But before we start the video guys, if you have any computer or software related problem, please feel free to contact us by visiting our website and using the submit a problem button from there. And comment down below on our videos about your problem and don't worry, we will make a video for you to resolve it. Number 1. Check your hardware connections like power off and unplug and open the case or alternatively you can also check the cables and restart a computer number two update or install hard drive drivers for this press the window plus x then select device manager now in the device manager find and expand the disk drivers option now right click on your hard drive and select update driver and choose the option to search automatically for updated driver software and follow the instructions to complete the process. Number 3. Verify BIOS like UEFI settings. For this, you start a computer and enter the BIOS like UEFI settings by pressing the specified key. Usually, it is F2 or F10. Now, navigate to boot or advanced tab and ensure that your hard drive is listed as a boot option and adjust the boot order if necessary. Now, if your hard drive uses Advanced Host Controller Interface or AHCI, make sure that AHCI is enabled in the BIOS like UEFI settings. Now, save any changes made in the BIOS or UEFI settings and exit. Your computer will automatically restart. Number 4. Perform a Windows Repair Install For this, if your computer is in the preparing automatic repair loop, forcefully shut it down by holding the power button then turn it back on. As Windows 10 or 11 starts to load, interrupt the boot sequence by pressing the power button again while the Windows logo is displayed. Do this 3 times in a row to trigger the Windows recovery environment. Now in the advanced startup option, just select troubleshoot option. And under troubleshoot, click advanced options. Number 5. Scan for malware or viruses. For this, type Windows Security in the Windows search bar. After that, in the Windows Security window, click on Wires and Threat Protection. And under Current Threads, click on Quick Scan to perform a basic scan. But for a more comprehensive scan, you can also choose Full Scan and follow the instructions to complete the process. If any threats are detected, Windows Defender will provide options to remove or quarantine them. Number 6. Perform a Hard PC Reset for this, shut the windows if it's open. Now, hold the power button down until no power is present if it's not the system is powered. And whenever your laptop is attached to any external devices, just unplug them. Now, remove the battery from the battery compartment after unplugging the power cord. And hold the power button for a further 15 seconds. You'll see the power light momentarily blink. Now that the power cord has been reconnected, just switch on the system. Number 7. Hardware Diagnostics For this, press the window key plus R to open the run box. Now in the run box, type msgt.exe slash id device diagnostics and press enter. And from there, click on next to run the troubleshooter. Number 8. Run chkdsk scan For this, open start, search by command prompt, right click the top result and select the run as administrator option. And from there, type chkdsk slash f, c and press enter. Make sure to replace c with the letter of the drive you want to check if it's not a system drive. Now, press y when prompted to schedule the disk check on the next restart. And after that, just simply restart your PC to apply the changes. So this was it for the video guys. We hope this video helped you solve your problem. If it did, then make sure that you give this video a like and subscribe to the channel. And if it did not, then don't worry. Just comment down below the issue and we'll try to figure out what is wrong with your specific case. Thank you for watching.